are at Sesky Raj and it's absolutely Any minute, don't you think? Yeah, it feels like you're walking between stone giants or something the gods have just created. It's unreal, just all these huge pillars of rock just sticking up out of the, the pine forest. And you've got natural pathways, but then they've built steps which have worn away. So yeah, it just so looks how like... They've, how they've carved into the rocks and created these very natural looking steps mm. is amazing, isn't it? just it? looks like that they were there originally. And all the natural thing. corridors and little alleyways. And you think, it's... where do you go now? And then you just go through this tiny little crevice. Yeah, yeah. like it's really narrow. Um, Up and down. So... And it's also cool as well because the roots, you've got to love the roots of trees when they're exposed. And in this forest, you've got all the roots because so many people have walked over them. It's just like they're smooth and shiny like marble. The texture's like marble, it's just crazy. The place is full of perfect little Christmas trees. We could even have this one in the van, it's so cute. of the whole park. Yesterday afternoon we came down to Prachov Rocks but it was so busy so I found out the opening times went off parked up for a bit came back at six o'clock you don't have to pay four euros for parking and you can just come into the park when it's quiet and not pay again. And not pay. Of course, we didn't know this. We, we didn't think we'd be able to come on the walk. But yeah, you come after six, you don't have to pay. And you get the whole walk to yourself. So yeah. You've got a good few hours before dark. So it was perfect for us, you know, with the dogs and that as well. Because obviously they're not mad keen on loads of kids and loads of crowds. So Especially it was Disney. great. This morning, We are literally, us. literally the only people here. We've got up at, uh, it's at about six, six o'clock. Again, the ticket office isn't open until eight. You don't have to pay the park until eight. So we've, we've got another hour and a half of this amazing national park all to ourselves. Definitely got to be um, not too much of a big person to fit through here. Like it's quite a tight squeeze at times. Just when you thought there was no way through, this place is crazy. about it. Charlie loves it here. <laughs> the animal instincts are coming out. Loving it, loving it. Little cave dogs. Prehistoric cave dogs. <laughs> centuries ago people settled here and lived here in amongst these rocks in amongst these rock formations and you can see why because it's like different little corridors different rooms here you can have your bedroom there your kitchen down the hallway there you know what i mean 
it is a perfect ready-made home and it's going to protect you from all the elements you get bad weather there's plenty of little crevices to hide to escape it perfect defensive point as well and people or hordes or tribes that are attacking you it's perfect for hiding away watch people up on the top there climbed up and then yeah you can imagine like a whole kind of tribe or something living here loads of people can't you it's completely protected it's totally ridiculously flat Apart from here, you've just got these hills rising up and then these monoliths just coming from nowhere so you can see for miles. So yes, this is a total case of the early bird catches the worm. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up and hit that like button below. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please do and keep the comments coming because we absolutely love to hear from you. And we'll see you in the next video.